There's a big problem I've recently noticed in the speaking world. We are returning to live events, which is fantastic. However, the problem I'm seeing is that we're treating the live audience of 2022 the way we treated live audiences pre-COVID. That is, pre-COVID, we would go to an event, we would speak to the audience in front of us, and then we would be finished. The audience of 2022 and beyond includes an important element that where most speakers are ignoring. What is this element? The camera. <laughs> I was invited to uh, attend an, a, a client's event a couple of weeks ago. And picture the scene. There's a long rectangular set of tables. People are sitting around the tables. At one end is where the speakers were. The other far end of the room was a huge monitor on the wall that was the online uh, audience. We, we could see all their faces in gallery view. In the middle of the table was the camera. Well, I noticed speaker after speaker go to the front of the room and give their presentations. And when the third speaker started, I noticed she was doing the same as everyone else. She would start by talking to the live audience, and then ever so often she'd look to the back of the room, thinking she was talking to the online audience. And all of a sudden it hit me. She's not looking at the camera. So all that the online audience was seeing is what you saw at the beginning of this video was my uh, side of my face, side of my face, me looking past the camera, no connection. This is a new habit we have to get into. Six years ago, I picked up an important piece of advice about speaking and coaching speakers. Notice when you go to events where there are large screens on, on stage with the speaker. People don't typically watch the speaker. They watch the screens, right? We are conditioned to look at screens. That's just how it is in our world now. Well, this advice carries over into the new hybrid world we're in. Whenever we're presenting at an event, we should always look for the camera. That is the most important member of the audience. Not because the online audience is more important than the live, by the way. It's because... When you look at the camera, you're literally looking at 10, 20, 100, 500, 1,000 people with that one view. You've got to pay attention to your live audience, obviously, but make sure you always include the camera. It's a new habit we have to get into. So please, when you're giving presentations, don't make the mistake of thinking you're talking to me because you're looking at me on screen, just like you wouldn't do in the safety or the comfort of your home office. Got to include the camera if you want to have maximum impact at all future presentations.